right? They're gonna feel so not a straight. Hi! Hey! hey. 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 How are you? Good, how are you? Mm -hmm. Good to see you. Yeah, you too. Hi. I'm, just, I'm in a teaching hey. mode. Good, keep teaching. Oh, you can have a hug, Ah, you messed the video oh, up. Now I got it. Sorry, you got it. I'm always doing it. What's Six up? nine. What's up? <laughs> uh, so yeah, so you're there. So you're here, so not you. So talk to me about your relationship with Lauren. So my relationship with Lauren, it started um, before I came to college because I actually had a cousin that came, that went to Jackson State. Can I say his name? Mm -hmm. Kyler Ritchie. So I was telling him, he was, he was at my graduation party. So I was telling him like kind of what I wanted to do, like work in sports. He was like, oh, I have someone named Lauren still looking for girls. Since you come in, I can ask her. And so he asked her for me. And so when I did get to school, um, I went for an interview and I got the job. And so that's where it all started from. So I'm forever grateful for my cousin, Kylan. Shout out to you. But um, that's when it all started. So this is about to be my third year being a uh, student athletic trainer so uh lauren lauren was hard at first because you know how you get to know people but now i love lauren to death all the things that she taught me all the time she was hard on me it helped me grow as a person like i brag about her all the time like in jackson i say i get it from lauren i just get it from lauren but that's made me who i am like she mm -mm. she probably i'm gonna say she probably didn't like me at first because of how i used to like you know, work or my work ethic, but I also, she helped me build my work ethic. My work ethic, she helped me be more comfortable and stuff like that. So, I love Lauren to death. Like, so, it's spring break for you. Mm -hmm. so you didn't go to the beach. Mm -mm. You didn't go home and relax and kick it or whatever. Mm -mm. You came to Colorado to increase your skills. I did. So, talk about the mindset of like giving up your spring break to, to come out here and be able to take skills back to Jackson State. Okay, so spring break, you know, everybody just want to go to Miami and go to stuff like that. But honestly, I'm actually only 20. So anywhere that I want to go, I can't really do anything. So that was already, that's one of the things that I just don't have to deal with. And also, so like, I'm trying to get better. I graduate next year. And it was an opportunity for me to come. Of course, I'm going to take it on my free time. Of course, I'm going to take because season also is about to start for us. So it probably won't be another time that I will um, be able to come and be around these people. I I got presented opportunities when I first got here. So I came in with like, um, coming with some, but I'm also leaving with something too. So that's what it was all about. Like, and being around people that I used to be around, you know, it's just great. There's a lot of familiar faces here, mm -hmm. not just Coach Prime, but like the yeah. coaching staff, coaching staff, trainers, mm -hmm. me. Like, mm -hmm. it's a lot of folks. And a few players. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. And I knew I was coming to like a familiar like environment. So I, I wasn't coming in uncomfortable. Yeah. So, so what's next for you? Okay, so, um, so I'm gonna go back to Jackson and just continue to be on my grind. Like take things I learned from here, like this past week, and utilize it in Jackson, so I can like help build myself more to get ready when I want to go to um, graduate graduate school. Like I feel like if I know how to do things on my own before them actually teaching me things I need to know, I feel like it will help me in the future. Alright, so a slow, consistent release, right? The first, the bolt you hear, and you're gonna hear it, it sounds exactly like that. Okay. That's the top number. Remember that number in your head, okay? And you're listening for the last, the bolt, and that'll be that bottom number, right? So normal blood pressure, right, is 120 over 80, okay? So, Alright, so how does it feel to have like the Jackson State crew here for spring break? Um, for their spring break? It feels amazing. It feels whole. I feel like the family is complete now. Like, I just feel like I got an army behind me. I just feel like everything is going smoothly how it's supposed to go. Like, it's life, and I'm loving the life. Like, I just love my family so much. I feel whole, complete. Now, we're going into officially uh, spring practice, which means your duties pick up, then going to the spring game. How excited are you like to really be getting into football? Now? I'm super excited. I'm ready to see the players. I'm ready to see some personalities. I'm ready to see how the rhythm is going to go as far as like the structure and practices and how the coaches interact. I'm ready to meet the new coaches. Well, I've met them, but like I'm ready to see how they operate. I'm just ready to get the flow of football to go. Like 
was ready for football to start. We love football. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And you, uh, again, you had the, uh, your former co-workers at Jack State mm -hmm. come from their spring break. Were you able to show, show them, them around, around, teach them some things about Colorado that they could take back? Yes, yeah, so we're actually going out today. We're going to see the campus a little bit more because Matt Drew has been very hectic. And it's early mornings, early mornings, so that means we crashed early as well. But um, we're taking them to go see the rest of the campus. So, yeah, that's going to be a vibe, and I'm going to update y'all about that. But right now, the facility is great. They love the facility. They love the vibes. It's just like picked up like we never will, honestly. Are you breathing? I'll try. Deep slow breath. I'll try. Deep slow breath. So Jess, you mm -hmm. gave up your spring break to come to Colorado and work. Yes, I did. So talk to me about that. So I just felt like it was a great opportunity. Um, it's basically like an internship almost to just get more in, like more experience. It was way different. Like it's way like more like advanced almost, but it's like a good thing for me to learn so I can take back to the school and enforce it on them. So I liked what I experienced. It was really good. Like I learned so much just by being here for like three days. And I could take so much back to the training room to help the other trainers with us. So we could all be in one and we could all help each other out. So talk to us about your relationship uh, with Lauren. I love Lauren. She put so much discipline in us, like, like time-wise, like time management. She helped us with that. She won't let us, like no excuses is made where like, it's really accountability. You really have to take on your own things and like keep going, keep pushing yourself. And she taught us that, like to discipline, make sure we always straight, never let anything come into the workforce and the work area and just handle everything outside and just keep it professional. And that's what she taught me, a lot of professionalism and a lot of accountability. So Coach Brown was excited to see y'all. Yes, and we excited to see him too. Yes, we were so glad to see him, and all our friends were basically telling us he was excited to see us, which was great, because we all missed him. Like, we missed him a lot. But, and, and what does it say about him and Lauren, like, for you guys to come out here and, and wanting to help you take things back to Jackson State to help that athletic training with you? It's just showing that they want us to grow. They see the potential in us, and they just basically putting it in our hands. So, yeah, they basically helping us to, like, help out our school. And, yeah. Now, you could have been on the beach, you could have been home, it's Everywhere. spring break, but you came to Colorado. Yes, because a great learning opportunity, and plus, who wouldn't want to see their friends? See them grow from where we were to at the top? Why not? And then, just, we get to see everybody, not just our friends, our old coach, Lauren especially, everybody was just excited, and we were so excited too. So, yeah. You hate for it again? Yes, I will come back, for sure. As long as I get invited, I will come back, every time. Alright, now start those stretches. So bring him over. So she's gonna do the stretches I need that I do. Or do you want you want a couple more minutes? <laughs> Which one? So move the Vaseline. Bring him over, slide over. She's gonna we're gonna have those stretches. Oh, is this the